Shouting, we don't want to fight, we want to talk with love. This activist in Zimbabwe is moments later beaten with a stick by riot police. Stan Zavol Wadsa was just trying to offer them flowers, hoping to open a dialogue a day after police used tear gas and water cannon to break up the crowd during an anti-government demonstration. I can't stand properly, but I will continue to stand for my right, because what is mine is mine. The freedom that I'm fighting for is mine, generations to come. I know the enemy feels otherwise, but this flower campaign will bring sanity to the militarization that we have suffered since independence in 1980. On Wednesday, around 200 people marched to the capital Harare, protesting against the country's deteriorating economy. <laughs> They fear plans to reintroduce local banknotes in a bid to ease the dollar shortage could instead open the door to rampant money printing, just as it did in 2008, causing inflation to hit 500 billion percent, wiping out people's savings and pensions. President Robert Mugabe has a long record of cracking down heavily on street protests. But officers beating citizens armed only with flowers is a first for his 36-year reign. If you don't represent women in politics...